Hello guys, I'm going to show you two attacks from the Neo Belly, okay? So I'm going to start in a cycle throw. So uh, just to review the how to get to the Neon Belly, uh, the way I like it, if I, if I just go and, and jump Neon Belly, most of the time the guy like bring the leg across, so it's hard for me to put the knee on the belly, okay? So the way we're going to do it, we're going to start here. I still want to get a grip here on the collar. But this end over here is gonna get a grip on the pant and I'm gonna frame his leg with my forearm. Okay, I'm gonna frame the legs. The way I can bring my leg across and finish on the neon belly. Okay? Remember also my feet. I wanna touch on the hip, the way you don't have too much space to replace the, the half one. Okay? So now if he move or whatever I can I can I, I follow him. Now, the most common reaction, the guy's gonna push, try to push my knee and hip escape, right? So as soon as he does that. He's, gonna get, he's giving me all this space for attack the arm, okay? So I'm gonna go with my hand, the one I have in the pants, under the arm, all right? And now I'm gonna lock my hands together, I'm gonna bring it and glue it to my chest, okay? Now, the far leg is gonna step behind, I spin, and I finish with my arm work, all right? That's my first attack. One more time, we're here. I have the, the grip of the collar. This one I'm gonna frame legs, right? So I think, knee on belly, if you push, I'm gonna go here, drop the arm and glue it to your chest. I like to hold the both hands together just to like, uh, to get like a stronger grip and glue it towards me. It's like a Kimura uh, movement like for his arm. So I'm gonna glue it, step, spin, and finish with my elbow, all right? Now my second attack, what happened? I'm gonna, again, same thing, I'm gonna grip on the collar, I'm gonna set up from here, grip the collar, frame the, the legs. Okay, I'm gonna go, in your belly, but this time he didn't like push with the hand, he just have the hand, the hand really tight, so I can't actually get the, the arm, okay? So what I'm gonna do is gonna give some, uh, the, the hand I have in the, in the collar, I'm gonna give some lapel from my other hand, okay? So here, I'm gonna move that way, to open, I'm gonna go this hand instead. I can't get the arm, I'm gonna go for the neck. I'm gonna put four fingers inside, all right? It's gonna do like a, like a baseball bat. Great, okay, so I'm here. Now what happened? The only hand is gonna bug me like for a choke, it's gonna be the one here. So I'm gonna bring my knee, the one I have on the, on the, on the belly, I'm gonna bring it across the arm, okay? Over the, the his bicep. Now I'm gonna spin all the way around, look. I trap his head, it's kind of like going to sit in his head and I'm going to look to the other side. Put my chest down and finish my choke, okay? I kind of want to like lock my both uh, elbows and spin with my arms. So a really strong choke. So one more time, we're here. I sit up, I grab the collar. Here, I'm going to frame the legs. That way he don't bring his legs uh, and bug me for go to the Leon belly. So I'm here, I'm going to bring my knee across. If you don't, as I give you the space for the armbar, I want to give me lapel, four fingers inside, I bring my leg, my knee next to his head, and I spin all the way. And finish my choke. Alright? Thank you guys.